Hey guys, back for another beer review. Today I'm going to be reviewing Zane's uh, Berry Cider. So he suggested I leave this for three to four weeks in a warm place, which I've done. So we'll, uh, we'll crack her open. That wasn't really any hiss off the top there, so hopefully it's carved up. Um, I'll pour it out. Doesn't seem to be any um, carbonation zones. So I'm wondering if the cap um, was not fitted properly. But anyway, it's um, poured up a very nice sort of rose sort of colour. Um, nice and clear as well, so that's cool. So I'll just tell you a bit about it. So I understand it's made using Brayburn apples and um, Zane has created or captured a wild yeast um, used that for fermentation. Um, he's also used a multivitamin drink which I think may be the berry where, where it gets the berry flavour and colour from. And then he's used three litres of fresh up crisp apple juice and um, also I think a kilo of sugar. So yeah, here it is here. Um, the reason I poured up two glasses is I'm going to give a glass to Mrs. Dino who is sitting opposite me on the other side of the table. But this is mm -hmm. going to have a non-base appearance on the... Just the speaking part. Yeah, maybe the odd speaking part. So we'll have a smell. So, yep, so it's clear, there's not a lot of carb carbonation, but that's fine. You can smell the alcohol off the top, eh? It's quite, quite strong. It smells nice, doesn't it? It smells like wine. Yeah. I was going to say, it smells, yeah, it smells... It smells, like a... smells like a nice, nice wine. But, um, yeah, you can definitely smell the alcohol coming off the top, so... Let us know how strong it is, Zane, if you, or if you do know that. But um, let's have a taste. Mm. It's, it's nice, though. Mm -hmm. It's nice. It's different to, I'd say it's more of a wine than a cider. It tastes like it's got a. Yeah. I'm just trying to think. Not a Chardonnay, it's not. Yeah, I don't know if you inadvertently um, meant to create a wine, but it um, definitely tastes more of, like a wine than a cider. But it's not a bad thing, it tastes very nice. So it tastes a bit like that one of those Lindau's? Lindau Fraze, maybe? I know Fraze mm. has got strawberries in it, but similar sort of yes yeah, definitely got a like a fruit like a Sauvignon Blanc um, smell this is Dino says a Sauvignon Blanc sort of smell and taste it's nice mm. still drink plenty of it very nice thing that is very nice Mm. I'm not a huge wine drinker, but um, I could definitely uh, drink this. I mean, if I bought a bottle of wine and that was in it, I'd definitely be happy with it. So did you say it's got a vitamin C supplement in it? No, I think um, it's got a multivitamin mm. drink, which is probably where the berry... Like a Barocca or something? No, no. No, I think like a berry, um, berry juice of some sort, like a packaged berry juice. I could be wrong, Zane. Just sing out. I think it, you said NJ. I think it was multivitamin drink. Um, but it's also got the fresh up crisp apple in it. But yeah, that's that's very nice. Maybe you should go into the wine making um, business, Zane. Hmm. Fantastic. 
and um, yeah, the fact it's got no visible carb carbonation um, that fits perfectly with it um, tasting like a wine. So, um, so when was it bottled? It was bottled 20th of May. So very nice, eh? Cheers for that. I'm glad um, we got to try it. Imagine this would go down very well with the ladies. <laughs> Is that right, Mrs. Dino? No, definitely not. Yep. Okay, Mrs. Dino <laughs> approved, so that's good. Okay, guys, thanks for watching, and we will catch you next time. Uh, check out Zane's channel. Um, I'll stick a link in the description below. Okay, cheers.